Yo, 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 guys! What is up? Gaming Cash is back this week with another FIFA 16 career mode installment. Simply because Manchester United have signed a they've they've just signed a centre back. I I don't know what's happened here. What what is what is going on? Manchester United have have, have signed a centre back. What? No, this is crazy talk, man. So they have actually signed a centre back. It took them. Uh, over, I don't know, what's it been like? 10 years? 10, 20 years maybe? But they've finally done it! They've finally signed a centre back! Oh my god, I'm so excited! And this guy, this centre back we have signed is known as Eric Bailey. Centre back from Villarreal. He is a very good defender from what I've seen. And I have been watching a few of his games to, you know, just get a feel of what he can do. So, what I'm going to do now with this new FIFA 16 career mode, I'll be adding transfers along with the real life transfers we make. So hopefully, Eric Bailey will be the first of many transfers. So let's go ahead and sign him right up. Man, I'm so excited. Okay, let's go. Eric Bailey. How do you spell his name? Is it B-A-I-L-Y or is it L-L-Y? There is Eric Bertrand Bailey. I think his current rating in this is 80, if I'm correct. It is 78 or 80. Let's go for 15 million straight in. Now the price tag as well on Eric Bailey was it was 30 million, I believe. They paid something in the region of 30 million. Now Villarreal bought him as a replacement for Arsenal flop uh, Gabriel because he was from Villarreal as well. And you know what? I'm glad that transfer happened because we found a beast in Bailey and you know what? He's gonna Arsenal smash it while whilst Bournemouth. Gabriel at Arsenal is an absolute Villa. flop. Chelsea. So yeah, in your face Chelsea. Arsenal. Yeah. And he has accepted my offer. Now let's give him 80,000 a week and... Oops, not 89. Not 89. There we go. Crucial. Now guys, we you know what, from watching the Premier League in the season just gone, Chris Smalling was crying out for a powerful you know, defensive partner. And he had Blind working with him. Blind was okay, you know, he did his fair share. I was impressed with him, but ultimately he's not a defender and because of that we did suffer in a lot of aspects in many games and you know Fosu Mensa came along he was he was a great player but just not the one we needed at the time you had Paddy McNair he slowly faded away um, so this addition of the defender was massively massively needed and yeah look 80 so let's throw him straight away in there for Jones not bad not bad at all I think the combination of Bailey and Smalling I think Smalling will keep his position. He's proved himself to be a good defender. And you know what? He'll only get better and better under Mourinho. So this partnership right here is going to be very, very exciting. I'm still in shock that they've signed a centre-back. I mean, what came to their senses? What made them do this? It's incredible. But you know what? I think it's quite a shock to some people as well. Because everyone thought Ibrahimovic would be announced as the first signing under Mourinho's reign but it wasn't so let's find out what's going on there very quickly so the Ibrahimovic news apparently is reported that he can't sign for United until his PSG contract expires basically and that is set to expire at the end of June now other reports are saying that his contract with PSG had finished and he's now a free agent and now we're getting reports that it can't happen until it actually expires now I've been reading report after report after report to find what's going on to find some truth behind this and you know what guys I can't seem to make sense of this because we should have signed him we should have we should have announced him early this week you know late last week this deal should have been done now but there is something in the works something which is stopping this from happening and that can be very scary because Ibrahimovic is a player we want. He's a player we need because he's just he's just a star, and he, this star will bring in other stars. It's just how it works. But nevertheless, we have signed a centre back. You know what? This you guys just be happy we've signed a centre back. It's a great time. 
to be a Manchester United fan. Mourinho will absolutely smash it once you know everyone's over the hangover from the Euros. Then he'll have a good solid month to whack out the transfers. A month or two. I think it's a, I think it's about two months. Yeah, two months. Two months to whack out some solid transfers. And believe me, guys, he will absolutely smash it. And hopefully this guy right here, Zlatan Ibrahimovic, would be our next signing. And if it is, well, I can't wait to see this happen. The link up between Rooney, Ibrahimovic, Marshall, Ibrahimovic is going to be absolutely fantastic. So, guys... This was the first part for my transfer video. I'm not sure when I'll be back. I mean, who knows how long it'll be before we get another transfer. But, guys, if there's anyone you want to see in this Manchester United team, if there's anyone you want to see Jose Mourinho signing, feel free to comment below. And but for now, guys, that is a wrap. Thank you for tuning in today with my transfer update of the beast, Eric Bailey. Hopefully, I can be back very, very soon with another transfer update for you guys along with transfer rumors so thank you for watching today and i'll see you guys very soon don't forget to like and subscribe peace out guys